Whoa, whoa. Oh, whoa, look at you. Whoa. Welcome back to what my channel is supposed to look like. What are you doing? Oh, that's what you're doing. What are you doing? You make it sound like she's like choking you. I, right. I swear he does that all the time. I'm literally just putting your onesie on. This is what happens when you just move into a place. It looked better than it did. <laughs> that's the sad part. Are you satisfied with how your bedroom look? Oh, okay. I she cut you enough. off. That's how bad it is. Outfit of the day check. Mr. Fly Guy. Oh now we gotta find my socks. goodness. I decided to vlog today because why not? We're bringing back some of that content that you guys love so much. I'm, I'm a decent vlogger and I've gotten really good. So I'm gonna keep it up. I wanna talk to you guys about some more money I spent. So Mr. Beast was talking in a podcast he did with Andrew Schultz. He was talking about how much money he invests in his channel and in his content. And I'm like, man, you know what? I do the same thing, but on a much larger scale. Everything I make, I spend on content, my channel. Uh, obviously, aside from paying for things that I have to live and whatnot. So today I was like, you know what? I'm going to stop coming at myself and embrace it. And I bought the Creator Now Boot Camp. I don't know what it's going to do for me, but hopefully it's going to make me a better YouTuber. And that's what I'm excited for. Trying to vlog with this Sony is so heavy, but it's a six week boot camp program. And I'm really excited because I just, I think it's going to do a lot for me. I'm pretty sure like Eric created it. And I know a guy on Twitter who literally grew his channel from like nothing to like 50 K and he did the creator boot camp, which taught him how to do it. I'm really excited. And I feel like I'm a, I'm a pretty decent content creator already, but I feel like if I just grow on the skills I already have, I can be amazing. This room is a little bit more so complete. It looks a lot better than all the others. I'll just say that. How do you feel about me buying the Creator Bootcamp? I'm for it. Is that one of my better purchases as of late, would you say? Yes, yes? definitely. That's why I was like, go for it. What are you about to put on my son? No. Oh my goodness. They don't fit. Saved by the bell. He said you're struggling, mom. Celebrate Breast Cancer Awareness Month, guys. Riding shotgun in my own car always feels so weird. I love it. When you drive my car, like, I love sitting in I thought you were saying you love driving my car. No, I get PTSD now. Dude, <laughs> I don't know if y'all saw my Instagram story, but somehow this girl popped two of my tires in the middle of us trying to sell our house and move. Uh, in our podcast, we talked a little bit about the process of trying to sell our house and how that went. So go check that out. But so imagine us trying to sell our house and Alyssa popping two of my tires in the midst of that. And Tesla tires aren't cheap, man. Like it sucks. She just almost hit a bird. I didn't almost hit a bird. The bird almost hit me. I feel like a lot of times people come at me for spending money on my channel. Cause I'm talking about the whole creator now purchase in this video, right? Mm -hmm. Do you think it's bad that I spend money? No. Oh, Do you ever think that I buy something that's like stupid for our channel? Like if I spend money on something, is it ever something it's so stupid? It's never something stupid. It's just sometimes like I would have thought you would have waited a little longer. Like the camera you're recording on, I knew you wanted it. And like getting it's not stupid, but I didn't expect you to get it as fast as you did. It was on, it was on my, what you call it, list. Your wish list? Well, my wish list for the year. Oh, I got a vision board. My vision board, yeah, there you go. I gotta stop putting like purchasable items on my vision board. Well, that's board what I'm saying. I'll like, it's them. a vision board, I think, to go within the year. And Julian literally had it done in like four or five months. 
I literally like, put a Tesla on my vision board and got it in February. Literally, but that's what I'm saying. Like two, <laughs> two months. It's not bad to get it done quick, but like I feel like if you like spaced it a little bit, like and got it like now now that you have two more months of the year like it would have been a little better. <laughs> not better but like it would have the only better. thing i didn't do on my vision board was learn how to box that's kind of insane to think about I did a lot this year like julian's so weird that like he had something about piano and literally bought a piano like it's stuff like that where i'm just like dude what <laughs> there you have it i buy things to be smart Target runs with a sleeping baby. Amazing. Guys, we messed up. We oh, <laughs> you gonna put me on the spot like that? Can you explain how we messed up? So we were checking out at Target and we were going to leave and we were going to a grocery store across the street to go pick up dinner and lunch and whatnot. And Julian had taken the baby to the car to load the car while I got Starbucks because there's Starbucks in Target. And I was like, oh, I'll just get my coffee here and I'll meet you at the car. Well, I didn't realize he would have loaded that fast. So when I got to the car, he was already done and in the car. We just got home and we're bringing all the groceries up. And he realized that he didn't take the paper towels and the, um, the soda we got from underneath the cart into the car. So he was like, did you grab it? And I was like, no. And he was like, oh, I left it at Target. For those of you who's had that happen to you, let me know in the comments. Has that ever happened to you? And am I an idiot? <laughs> probably an idiot right we need some lighting i'm probably an idiot right i know <laughs> i know i know i'm you know what it is i'm so excited to be vlogging today that i'm making stupid mistakes bro be honest why didn't you tell me to grab the stuff from target i mean that's a good that's a good reason but i just thought you would tell me come on baby let's go yeah good job come on come here baby come on just a little bit more you got this little bit good job high five it's october you know what that means family movie night what are we watching guys hocus pocus 2. i think it's your bedtime mister <laughs> he said what do you want to say to the people to end your night can you give us like something <laughs> no pictures please 